So in this video, we're revealing how to make money online just by reading books and how complete beginners are making $100 to $700 a day with no experience. More that after the intro. Hey guys, how's it going? Mike Vasile here. Welcome to this video. Before we actually begin, I remind you that Soul Spots have opened up for this week's free workshop, where it's the fastest and easiest way to make money online. Sign up for it in the link below. We have a 62 year old woman go from zero to 160 grand profit in 90 days, so check it out now. So I'm completely addicted to reading books. I just think it's crazy that there was literally someone amazing that was just, you know, survived hundreds of years ago that literally put their entire life and their thoughts in a book so that we did not have to make the stupid, dumb mistakes. I think people that don't read books are literally just kind of like idiotic because you are literally making the exact same mistakes that people in the past already have figured out. And here we are just kind of like monkeys bouncing our head against the wall, just making the same mistakes, right? So I just early on knew that, okay, the best people that will make the most money, that will become the most successful, that will make the least amount of stupid mistakes are, the, are gonna be the ones that are readers, right? Because readers create leaders. People that read the most make less dumb decisions as a traditional person who doesn't actually have the habit of reading. But what if? What if all of the books that you're already naturally reading, you actually make money from it? Because that was essentially my goal, right? Because I'm like an avid learner. I understand that what I do know for sure is I do not know a lot of things, but what I can do is learn a lot of things and acquire it and then share it out with those people. And again, that was literally the, the story behind my, for example, YouTube channel, right? Like before I started interviewing all of these people in my podcast, like this 11 year old girl that turned on $30 million or this guy that makes a million dollars from that I met here in Bali. If you literally look back in the past, it was just me documenting the things that I was learning in my life from the books that I was reading and then sharing it out to people of the internet and then turning that into money on accident that I didn't actually think was possible, right? That I literally didn't think I was possible. And it was a really cool concept because again, it just encouraged me and motivated me and incentivized me to continually be a learning machine because it's hard for me to learn things when there's a bunch of stuff stuck in my head. So obviously I would have to create content and let it out so there would be space in my head again for more information coming in. So what is like the concept of how people are making money then with just reading? Because it's very simple. When you read, it's not reading that actually, for, for example, I idealizes and solidifies that concept inside your mind. It's when you teach it and recommend it to somebody else is when that knowledge loop kind of like gets fulfilled. And not only did you teach it, but you learn it even more and you find a way to make money by just building an audience around that. Does that make sense? So here's an example of two people that were able to do it really well. You have this guy right here and then this guy right here. You're probably familiar with both of these YouTube channels. Now many of these people build their audience from just reading very interesting books. Like look at this, the ultimate self improvement book tier list, best to worst, 287,000 views. Look at this, 336, 8,000 views, 62,000 views, 1.9 million views. All this person's doing is just reading a bunch of books, writing down all of the notes on what not to do with their life and then sharing it out there, right? Another one, this guy does more specific books. He's like, okay, I read the Elon Musk books, eight lessons I learned from Elon Musk, or the book that changed my life, 1.9 million views. Again, that's a lot of views getting attention from things that he's already naturally reading. And that's what I like thinking about when I wanna make money line. It's like, what I'm already doing and how can I get paid to make money doing the thing that is already that I'm already doing. If I'm already gonna read, you know, like an Elon Musk book or this book about money, I might as well get paid for it, right? If I'm already taking notes on all the things that I'm learning, I might as well get paid for it. It's kind of like what I'm doing with this video. Now, once you start doing that, you start realizing how you can start catering to certain things, like whatever book that you read. If I read, for example, Rich Dad, Poor Dad, right? Summary. I would go ahead and see what people are actively searching for and I would put that in the title of my video or I would put that in the title of my blog on my blog right here when I go ahead and for example uh, write on for example bikefacile.com, right? I would literally go ahead and put whatever people are searching for and put it in the title. Now the moment I start doing that, I would create a blog article about it and I would create a YouTube video about it based off of what it is that I'm reading and all of the notes that I've taken, I would just constantly just share and share and share and share. The more that I share, the more uh, pieces of content that I create, the more you know audiences start getting attracted to me. Now, once I start having an audience that starts building and it's a lot easier than you think, you literally just gotta find out what book are you reading, right? So if I'm reading, for example, The Psychology of Money, The Psychology of Money, I can literally go ahead and put a lot of these different things the the psychology of money review make a video with that in the title you can see look at this 482 thousand views right 
all these people just kind of reviewing this book. 2.3 million views, uh, 300,000 views, uh, 8.9 thousand views. Just reviewing the books that you're essentially reading, throw it up there, create a blog article about it and a YouTube video about it. Now you have the attention, okay? But it's not just any attention. You have an attention of people that are avid learners, which is good because it's a really good way to make money. Now, once you have that attention and you build the audience, how would you actually monetize it? Well, one way that I monetize it is very simple. I utilize things like AdSense. So essentially, businesses will rent the space for my blog and my YouTube channel to essentially run advertising, right? And you can see from that business model alone, we'll literally pull in like, for example, 35 grand to 46 grand a month. Here's literally Google AdSense literally paying me directly to my account every single month. So it's just one way. What else do I like doing? I like recommending products and services through affiliate marketing, right? One affiliate marketing thing that you could do is just signing up for Audible's affiliate program and Amazon Associates where you could recommend the ebook or the audiobook version and you could become an affiliate for free and you can see that they will literally pay you in commissions for just recommending the ebook or the audiobook version through Amazon. Okay, and it's not just that. Any product that they go ahead and buy from Amazon, you would essentially get compensated for it. So what a lot of these people are doing is they're putting affiliate links into their content based off of the books they read. I mean, people are doing this for cameras, for the food that they bought, for the courses that they bought. Heck, you even see me do this with affiliate marketing. And that's how I was able to go ahead and pull in $346,000 in net commissions in affiliate marketing. And the beauty about affiliate marketing is I don't have to do any shipping, handling, or customer service. Some business already has the product and has the big team and all I gotta do is tap into that existing business. I get most of the money, they get most of the risk, and I can create passive income for myself. Does that make sense? And again, that's why I love passive income. That's why a lot of people in our community love affiliate marketing. I mean, you have Dina with affiliate marketing go from zero to 30 grand a month in five to eight weeks at 47 years old. Ilio did it, Greg did it at age 58 years old, Chris became a multimillionaire doing this, and Francisco did this from Chile, where the average income is $500 a month. And if you wanna go ahead and hear their stories, check it out on my podcast, as well as if you want us to hold your hand and get the entire step-by-step blueprint, then, step, then sign up for this week's free workshop below. Check out this video on this podcast right here, and I'll see you guys later. Woo!